Hello my friends, this is Mr. Captain Bufo, and today we'll be doing the 8th episode of Clash of Clans. This is Spending Spree, and uh, as you can see we have quite the elixir and gold saved up right now. I actually just spent a little bit of that elixir on upgrading my Dark Drill to level 3. But this is what the clan looks like currently, because I haven't made a video in a while. Matt, 10 is in crystal, uh, so we got some like, we had two crystal members, and now we just have one. Uh, but there it is growing every single day. Um, by the time you'll see this video, it'll be grown even more. Uh, we're getting back up from uh, about a week ago, maybe a week and a half, whenever we kind of had a drop. And a lot of people left the clan. We were down to like 35 members. So we're getting back up there. Things are looking good. But anyway, yeah, that's that's what's going on. Um, what am I looking at? Yeah, that's, that's the clan. Uh, I put Cody down there. He is kind of running the feeder clan, um, all 12 of the members down there, because I don't really play on my second account a whole lot, well, really at all. Um, it's just not my thing. So, um, we have a free builder, and, uh, hmm, don't really know what we're going to do with it yet. I haven't really decided. I have tons of money. I don't really know what I want to do with my money, because I just didn't really decide anything here. I think we'll upgrade this, whatever, whatever, I don't care. Um... I just have tons of money laying around, and it's just not worth it. So, um, let's fast forward five hours into the future. So, uh, let's see. What are we looking at? Alright. Yay, Tyler. Um, alright. So that Dark Bear, not Dark Bear, that Dark Elixir storage is now upgraded because we are five hours into the future with this. And my dragons to level three are now five hours closer to being completed, um, so that's a fun time, hmm, okay, I think, yeah, I, I got a level 4 clan castle, so here's what it's full of right now, I don't know if I showed you guys that before, because I haven't made a video in forever, let's look at, uh, the legendary Captain S, and his amazing raids, I think I showed one of his raids last video, I mean, look at that, if you guys had that much sleep, you would be well, which is, because, check that out, that is just falling. Pretty sure he uh, 200 percent this guy, and I don't even know how he got this. I would say A plus, saying this is brilliant. Yeah, so just goes to show you that Clash Clans isn't always about having fun. You kind of do what you want. It's just, you know, it's just. Wait, I think I misspoke. It is about having fun. It's not all about competition. Um, here I'm training some troops. So. Basically, I got the P.E.K.K.A. I don't know if I showed you guys that. I'm getting the Golem. You know, I have about two days left on that. Um, and I have a Barb King level 4. He's a swag beast. He gets all the bitches. Um, I have some goals that I'd kind of like to do. So as soon as my dragons are level 3, I'm going to get P.E.K.K.A. level 2. Because I have the money. Right now, I don't really have anything to do with it. And... I believe the P.E.K.K.A. level 2 is somewhere between 7 and 10 days of an upgrade. And while I do that, I'm going to upgrade um, my level 1 Dark Barracks to at least level 2 or 3. Probably just level 2, and then I'm going to get regular Barracks, uh, some of them up to P.E.K.K.A. level. Because that's basically the only other thing I have to do with Elixir. Because I can't upgrade my army camps or my spells or anything like that. Here's how my attacks have been going lately, just getting a lot of loot. I mean, for the past 3 months, I've just been... Just doing some, just goblin raids. I mean, that's it. I mean, this, this here is a 750k raid, right here, and it's just I, I search sometimes for 45 minutes, just looking for people like this, because I just want to get loot. I don't really feel like pushing. I mean, I've been farming in gold three for a while. I could, I could push, so I might do that sometimes too, because it's kind of getting boring. Especially whenever you keep coming across people who don't have a lot of loot down here. So I feel like once I have my golems and my P.E.K.K.A. is upgraded to level 2, then I'm going to do wizards to level 5, I think is the order of operations. I mean, well, actually no. I don't think I can say that either, because I have to get my wall breakers and my giants to level 5. And then I'll start doing go wipe raids, because I'm kind of excited for that. I think go wipe would be a pretty fun strategy to use. Um... I think just roll up in a base with um, a level 1 golem because I don't really feel like getting those golems up anymore because that would just be a pain in the ass. 
Um, because it's like, what, 60,000 Dark Elixir or something to upgrade them to level 2. And that just, that just touches my butthole again and holds 60,000 Dark Elixir. Um, oh, whoopsie daisy, the giant bombs are gone, my bitches. So we're gonna break open this side here and drop some gobbos to prepare that go. I've been doing lots of raids like this, literally, probably three months now, and I'm averaging about 200k of each per, per raid. And that's just, it's, I think it's worth it because I've been able to power upgrade a lot of stuff. I able to get all the new Town Hall 8 defenses up to the same level that my Town Hall 7 defenses were. I have three level 9 cannons, so I'm starting on the cannons. I took a break apparently to start some wizard towers, because why the fuck not? Um, those wizard towers are a fun thing to do. So we're going to take some of that gold from there. And take a loss, because nobody really even cares. I think I'd also like to upgrade my def defenses. I think the order is going to be um, my wizard towers. I have two of them going up right now. Uh, by the time you see this video, there will be a third one probably going up, or maybe just later that day. Um, <clears throat> because, as I said, i got plenty of gold. I've made two million in, like, the last six hours. And I've made, like, Tons, so just there's no really reason for me not to. Um, I see myself getting my splash damages up first, probably my wizard towers to level uh, five, and then I'll probably do my. I'll probably finish up cannons after that because I have like two more, and then after the cannons I'll do mortars, and then I'll probably. I don't really know. I'll probably either go for um, wizard towers level six that nice all purple swiggity diggity or maybe uh, archer towers level nine is probably more likely what i'll do um and all the way trying to get some walls up but anyway what do you like what do you think of this base this is the a base i did all by myself um i've seen other bases out there sort of like that I, the only thing i copied uh from an internet video was the sort of idea how to put uh, walls in the bulge around the uh hidden tesla there because a lot of people just have hidden teslas just sitting there in some part and so, um, apparently I decided at this point I was going to start moving storages around because depending on what I'm trying to push for, I'll put certain storages towards the outside and certain of them more towards the middle. Um, so yeah, um, what else is there to say? Oh yeah, lightning spell level 5, I'd really, really like to get that, but I just don't see myself having any time. If I could just, uh, so I have the money to get out of this, so, but it just takes so much time, I just, bleh. Uh, but anyway, here's the clan again. Uh, don't really, don't really know why I decided to show you it again. But this isn't exactly accurate. There's more people in gold. Like, I think three more of those silver guys went to gold. Um, anyway, General Derp, you see him there. He'll be going to uh, elder, like that elder, and then there's that elder. Let's list off the elders here. There's Evan, and then there's Jake, and then there's Griffin should even be an elder. Playlist, if you're watching this video, you're bad. Please donate, you're bad. Oh, I'm just, uh, Josh, there's an elder, you guys have seen him in my videos. Tyler Lock has been in like every single video. Um, Pat, he is with Placebo 1 or whatever. Justin, Rami, Cade. Um, and those are all the people that have earned at least a thousand donates in one season besides Palelu. Um, and they all, they all got it done. I mean, it's not that hard to do. Some people aren't up to the challenge, but I've gotten 2,500 donates in this clan. I mean, there's always people with open requests, as far as I know. Let's just tell these little swig figs that they're going to be on the internet, because it'll make their tiny little peens erect, and they'll be so happy. Um, so, what else is there to talk about? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I almost forgot. Actually, I didn't... I don't know. I still have a pumpkin bomb. I'm not going to show it in this footage, but it's in the very right hand corner. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with it because I don't really want to lose it, so I think I'm just going to keep it there, being my special friend. Um, <clears throat> because it's not really hurt anything out there, but I don't really feel like I want to lose it. I just want to keep it as a novelty item, you know. Um, so my Dark Elixir Drill is going to level 3. I think that's the max for Town Hall 8. And I'll be able to get ball sack tons of Dark Elixir. Um, also, because I'll be going up in the leagues, I can just drop those three lightning spells and then take the loss because I'm just that kind of a douche. Um, yeah, I don't really know uh, where I'm supposed to be, what I'm supposed to be talking about. I don't really ever 
plan these sort of videos. I just sit here and talk to you about boring shit. Um, but I think <clears throat> if you guys want to join the clan, please feel free to. If there's not open spots, then the feeder clan, and then we'll let you know whenever there is open spots. Because there's a whole lot of stuff that we donate that is, like, I don't know, like, I get P.E.K.K.A.s in my clan castle, I get, uh, level 3 and 4 dragons, uh, max level, like, giants and stuff, uh, thank you, Mike, shout out to him, um, and speaking while we're doing shout outs, um, if you're watching this, I think your name was, like, Carlson Freeway, or I don't even know, I don't remember what your name is, um, but there's some guy who I was Skyping with my friends the other day, and he joined my Skype call and told me he liked my videos, if you, Mr. Carl or Carson, yeah, it was like Carson something or other. Um, if you're watching this video, shout out to you, bro. Cool. Thanks for supporting my videos. Um, and back to business. Um, right around Christmas time, I'll be getting some iTunes cards, and that means gems. So, gems mean fifth builder, which means I can get this stuff out of the way a little bit faster, because I'm kind of, I'm kind of feeling like I can probably be Town Hall 9 by like February, but I don't think I'm gonna just hustle to Town Hall 9, because I have a lot of stuff to do. Um, I'm level 73 right now. I will probably be level 73 for like another two days until something upgrades and I get level 74. Um, I'm close to a couple achievements, so I can probably get some money off of that. But, um, let's see here. Fire King's awake. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Level 4, swag. Alright, my army camps are full, so let's do a raid. A solid lots of gold, and 41 minutes later, we found a raid that actually has some loot. Because down here, there aren't a lot of loot raids that you can actually get a ton from. I, the 750k one I probably spent mm, close to an hour searching, that's why I'd like to go on the loot if I can. But I figure I'll just drop some jobs and just take his money. Because that's just what I do. I'm a home. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that raid. Look at that my dogs go. It's not really an interesting strategy, it's just I get the loot and leave. I don't care if I win or not. Sometimes I try to go for 50%. Keep myself from going too low because I almost dropped into Silver One the other day. And Silver One, every, for me, all I find in Silver One is like really, really keen bad Town Hall fives and sixes. So that's just not my cup of tea. Um, yeah, so we're busting in, getting money. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's still one more little thing that needs to be a collector gold mine, whatever that needs to be. Um, I don't even know. Goblin, but good. Um, and so if there's anyone in my clan or anyone in my videos that you guys like to know more about, I will uh, just just ask in the comments because I had a few people ask if I could post their channel links in the description or something like that. Um, if you'd like, I can start doing that. So give me a give me a comment letting me know whether or not you want me to post the channel links of people that I play with in the description. Because in case you think they're funny or you like them or something, then I can just go ahead and post more of them. Or then I can just link you to their channel so you can watch their content that they've posted. Because I don't really see why not. So here I figure I'm just not going to drop any more troops because I'll probably pick up the 50% from that spell factory. And it doesn't even matter because now I've won and I don't have to feel bad. And I can even get myself 8 little trophies. So, I think there's not a whole lot else to talk about with this. Um, this has been my 15-minute Clash of Clans video that I thoroughly hope you enjoy. So thank you everyone for watching, and have a wonderful day. Rock kills, kill yourselves. Oh, swag. No, no, no. Not enough.